You're live with BBC News. Scientists say the average surface temperature of the world's oceans has surpassed the previous record set in 2016. The EU Climate Change Service has warned that the upward trend in temperatures has been caused largely by global warming. Our climate editor Justin Rowlatt reports. They've been taking measurements of ocean temperatures here in Plymouth for more than a century. And for the last 50 or so years, they've showed a slow but steady increase, up about a third of a degree a decade. Have we got a reading for today yet, do you know? I heard them say something around 18 or 19, which is wow. four degrees higher than it should be. It's been a similar pattern globally, rising sea temperatures and increasing numbers of marine heat waves. And it has just reached a new peak, 20.96 degrees Celsius, the highest global average sea temperature ever recorded. The world's warming waters are a dangerous trend, say experts. People's perspective is that the ocean, you know, it's so big, it's so vast that it can buffer you know, anything that humanity can throw at it. And the reality is that's not the case, though. You know, every, everything has a, its niche within the ocean and it's incredibly easy to, to break that niche and influence it and upset it. Take plankton. These tiny plants and animals are crucial to life on the planet. They're the basis of the entire marine food chain and produce half the oxygen in our atmosphere. So every other breath you take, and they are sensitive to heat. Many species have been migrating north as the world's oceans warm. Personally, I'm really concerned. The heat waves that we're experiencing on land and, and the marine heat waves that we're seeing are happening in unusual locations where we haven't expected them. But there is hope. Scientists are learning more about how the ocean ecosystems function every day. We have the renewable technologies that can tackle climate change by reducing our use of fossil fuels. We just need to make the change quickly.